Good morning, good evening, good afternoon, wherever you are, whenever you are. Thank you for watching my videos. I'm here joined with Inti Campo. Hello, people. And we are here to free your mind from central banking and get it into Bitcoin. <laughs> How are you doing, everyone? Oh my God, this is it's great to be back. It's Tuesday. Um, I, yesterday I took it off because I was actually built, uh, making another Evergreen video. If you saw the, the video that we posted yesterday, I did that a couple weeks back. And yeah, I plan to do a lot more like that uh, going forward. Uh, I really enjoyed that. And well, actually it was a lot of work, but um, yeah, I, I, think that's, I think it's more important to like get new people uh, into the space and have them see what they uh, what, what what learn about Bitcoin and uh, and what they can do with Bitcoin and so forth, right? Uh, take it step by step. Now, I don't expect people to to watch my videos and you know jump into Bitcoin, but hey, it's uh, it's a good introduction. And you know what? Eventually, you know somebody will show them, hey, you know what? This is really a good thing. Some of that they trust. This is a really good thing. So please share those videos out with everybody. Um, today show, we're going to be talking about, uh, Bitcoin, which way it's going to be going. Um, also, uh, there's somebody spamming the network. I'm going to, we're going to talk a little bit about that. Um, wow. And also Bitcoin has spent some time, uh, some time, quite some time above 10 K. So I'm happy about that. So we're going to do the TA, uh, on, uh, Bitcoin and Ethereum. And I don't know why. Oh, the autofocus is not picking up my face. That's why. <laughs> so... Uh, but before we do all that, Inti's got a few words to say. Yes, as always, people, it's worth reminding you that this video is for entertainment purposes only, and this is not financial advice. Please do your own research before putting any of your hard-earned money on the market. All right, so we're going to get into questions and answers, but not for the people who are watching this on YouTube after the fact. If you want to get in, participate in the question and answers, you're going to have to purchase the DJ15 tokens, and we'll talk more about that. But let's get into the uh, the TA right now. Alrighty. Uh, so there's only 31 of you guys, but that's okay. Um, uh, if if you're interested in watching it live, you can also watch it on Twitch as well. Okay. Let's get over to the 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 Bitcoin TA. So right now you can see that Bitcoin is stuck in this range, and it's bouncing. It's coming back down, rolling over in this range. And um, I'm surprised that it didn't go a little bit further, but uh, this trend line seems to be holding it down. Um, not so good because um, because I was expecting this thing to at least get, you know test the eleven thousand, maybe do like the hail mary return um, on this thing. Maybe it already did it, and that's probably why. Um, yeah, you know what. Um, it, kind of did it at this level here and this is like it just rechecking it oh, okay there we go it's rechecking it again here so that's why so if we um if we do a um a fibonacci level here you can see well it's not quite didn't do it get to the hail mary it did the uh the 61.8 uh, this is what i call the hail mary whenever it gets to a whenever uh, uh, the market comes back to the 78.6 and i do a, a, a uh, uh, short, I call that a Hail Mary on the uh, 78.6 or long, basically, um, on the 78.6. So it's coming the other way. Um, basically, I do the Hail Mary to that and I just uh, see what happens, right? Um, I don't always go jump into a Hail Mary, of course. So just, uh, yeah, it's uh, where I, where, what I call a trading plan where I just. Uh, I look for like some sort of like uh, what's called divergences and stuff like that before I get into this trade. Alrighty, um, are we gonna get to now? The question is, what's going on? What's 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 gonna happen? Right, that's the main in the medium short term. That's what you came to see right now. Is what's gonna happen here? Well, um, oops, did I undo? Hang on, let me see here. Did I delete something here that I shouldn't have? No. Uh, so, right now, um, we're bouncing off of this trend line, this trend line, and that's not good. Uh, it doesn't usually prices did not get to the apex of the, the these two uh, 
trend lines, uh, which is like almost like a, a, a pennant um, formation that we're seeing here. Um, and if we're testing this downward trend line for the, like, let's see, if we count it one, two, three, four, five times, and we do a sixth time, it's not likely to hold. Not likely to hold at all. And you can see there's no volume just yet, major volume coming in just yet. So we could see this thing breaking down um, pretty majorly, substantially. Um, after it breaks here, uh, then it's got to hold, it has to hold the $10,000 level um, uh, closing the daily above that. Failing that, failing that, um, yeah, we're heading down to 9,600 very, fairly quickly. Um, and probably even further down uh, to to a further level of like let's just see here if we go to the dailies all right let's see here we can go all the way back down to like 90 89 8900 approximately or the 9200 level around there I think it, it's more clear on this this chart here and where next this week yes oof. If we were to make a touchdown here this week, um, that's talking nine thousand, the nine thousand one hundred dollar level, approximately right here. Yeah, so that's where we're looking to see where Bitcoin starts to to, to turn around uh, if we break down um, through these um, through the ten thousand dollar level. Honestly, that seems like the most likely scenario at this point. Um, the five minute is like giving up here and there's probably gonna be more downside. Um, yeah, I would suggest you, uh, if you have any long trades, I suggest you start considering walking away from them. Um, anything happen, of course, right? No, no guarantees from the management, but that's what we see on the charts here. And it's unfortunate we didn't like, you know, paint a longer uh, picture Right where this, this would uh, this if if it came up to this red line here, which was eleven thousand one hundred level, bounced off of that, then bounced back off of this. Maybe we could have, like, stuck been stuck in this range for a little bit longer, um, but and then said oh, did some uh, more um, TA to see if we can get to fifteen thousand, but it doesn't look like it at this point. So sorry to sorry to disappoint. Sorry. <laughs> Alrighty, uh, so let's head over to ETH, Ethereum. And I think you, you guys can definitely hear me right now. Is that correct? All right, so let me let me know. Let me know in the chat group. Uh, let uh, Inti know. Now uh, they say now they say it's good. Okay, awesome, 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 awesome. Awesome, guys. Okay, let's head over to Ethereum. And uh, Ethereum is not looking good either we are on the other side of this trend line but ethereum likes to surprise so don't don't count it out just quite yet but if ethereum leads the way if you see ethereum start to like you know lose its lunch right and we break down below um the 320 level you know the bitcoin's following shortly afterwards if we break above the 420 level um, and, and we can smoke some weed with it, then we're going higher. <laughs> we're going to get high <laughs> on the 420. <laughs> so, yeah, uh, that's where I see with uh, that's what I see with Ethereum. We're, look, we're waiting basically to see which side, which direction Ethereum wants to go. We, you can see that the, um, the bands are, are, are nicely tightened up. It's not the, the, the most tightest band I've ever seen, but you know, that looks like it's ready to make a move uh, either way. So we'll have to wait and see. Uh, looks like the, ease, the, uh, the, the, the direction is pointing to the downside. So uh, unfortunately, that's probably where it's going. Let's just see if we can find any kind of information on the immediate short term with the uh, lower time frame. Yeah, there you go. The band is extremely tight on the, um, the four hour. And we've got an M looking pattern, and yeah, yeah we're broken, we're breaking down. It seems I got a stub on my recent trade. So yeah, looking looking really really bad here. Okay, um, 
let's get on to. All right. So if you're watching this this after the fact, and you you and you want to be able to uh, to watch this with the live show and also join in the question and answers, you could either uh, purchase. Uh, you could head over to www.pandora's wallet. Now we have our full website, the new website, um, fully operational. Right. You can always click on the legacy site to, to go back to it. But I feel that this one's much better. And um, here you'll, n you'll notice that um, that we have new price. We have a new pricing, right? It was still 50% off. So if you're interested, you could uh, subscribe and you'll have access to the, the videos. Also, um, if you don't want to subscribe to Pandora's Wallet and you just want to have access to live streams and so forth, you, there's um, the, you could always purchase uh, a DJ15 token, which will give you access to our Telegram group. Um, uh, that uh, that everybody where we we share the videos right uh, the live stream so you'll find that here and you'll have access to the live streams as well where um, you know you can have access to the question and answers period all right also uh, once again uh, the video is available on twitch right uh, twitch.tv a real da Vinci j15 you can find it, us there as well uh, with if you don't if you don't want to purchase any of the tokens, you don't want to purchase Pandora's wallet. This will not be 100% all the time. We will not be providing this uh, for Twitch, but for right now, the, if you uh, if you want to be participating in the stream, you can join in us on Twitch for absolutely free without purchasing uh, one single thing. Okay. Hey, sir. We should show we should show your uh, your followers a surprise you got for them. Oh yes, definitely. So with with the money that you guys have, uh, you, you guys are. I nearly fainted looking at that. <laughs> purchased here. Let me just switch screens so that you guys can actually see this a little bit better, right? Uh, I purchased uh, this right here. What is this, right? You're like, what? Most of you, are, this is a thread ripper, a 32 CPU thread ripper. This thing's a monster. This thing will be able to do our 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 uh, live streams. Very easily, so I'm really excited about that. You know how excited I am. <laughs> you know, you're very excited, aren't you? <laughs> you want to play video games? Yeah, of it. course. With that, with that screen, with that monster, <laughs> you're not going to, you're not going to see this studio again. <laughs> it's not because I built it. Alrighty, alrighty. So, all right, let's get on to the rest of the show. Uh, uh, I, I noticed that uh, Chris put out uh, a nice tweet, right? Uh, for everyone complaining that Grayscale has nearly 500,000 Bitcoin, I think you should probably stop selling it to them, right? That's, that's a good advice, Chris. Thank you for that one, right? Uh, people need to, yeah, it's time to like, you know, hodl like, like it's, uh, you know, 2017. <laughs> All right. Um, also, notice that uh, Bitcoin... Uh, Wow, I got I got one thousand likes on this one. Wow, Bitcoin has uh, seventy days above ten k and counting, right? Um, I really think that Bitcoin uh, is gonna break down, unfortunately, uh, and break down harsh. Right? Everybody's too happy about that ten k that we're above ten k level, so the market's gonna punish us for that. That that happy joy joy feeling that we get. <laughs> Unfortunately, yeah, market never, that, <laughs> the market never lets you get happy too much. I know too it long. doesn't. It never does. It never does. <laughs> and it's 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 just very. It's like it's just like slap you in the face kind of deal. Every single time mm -hmm. you want to get happy, or like no no. <laughs> All right, so um, everybody freaked out. I know this is old news, and everybody freaked out about you know the old bitcoins. Uh, moving right, the Bitcoin that was from May of 2010, um, and I'm sorry that I moved it and freaked you guys out. No, just joke. It wasn't me. <laughs> uh, it wasn't me. It wasn't me. And uh, because of the, because of the, you know the the the, move, the Bitcoin that moved in just before Black f f what was it Black the the Bl Black Friday right or the Black Thursday sorry Black Thursday where Bitcoin just dumped a uh, heavy 50 percent. Right, he guy, you know, moved eight million and sold them off just before. So, uh, yeah, I know it could have been freaky, but uh, nothing to worry about. What I'm concerned about is is this here. 
what is going on? A friend of mine pointed this out to me. And um, yeah, you notice how it sent it to a couple of vanity addresses, right? Uh, if you want to know what a vanity address is, basically, it just uh, you use a, a couple of video cards and and stuff like that. And you can you can actually call go through. You can tell it to hey look for these words um, in by creating a bunch of uh, keys, public keys and private keys until it finds finds um, an address with these words, even though they might not be in the right position, right? So you could go for let's and use, right? This is what they were looking for. And then um, and then it shows up anywhere in the text, anywhere. Um, um, and, and they might have to add like one here and one there so that it clears, it says, okay, well, one, let's, one, and then you could just look for that. And then it'll find it and then produce you a, a vanity address. And that's what they these guys did, um, if you're interested in learning about that. Um, also, they, they sent it to a lot of people, and this was not, this is not the only transaction that existed in, in, the, in, in the Bitcoin network. And I, I'm not sure what this guy's trying to prove. I think they're trying to do follow the money kind of thing. Somebody's doing analytics right on 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 bitcoin i don't see that this is going to they can they're trying to hack bitcoin or anything like that i bet you they're trying to do some analytics on the on the, the money that's they're sending because these are active addresses that they've sent it to not inactive addresses kind of interesting right i'm wondering what's what kind of dark forces are going on with that Alrighty. so uh with that said um I would like to um, I'd like to go I'd like to answer one question before we close off the show um, um, and for uh, the, the for the YouTube viewers who are watching this uh, after the fact and uh, yeah Inti, do you got anything for me uh, yes so we have uh, we have a couple of questions from uh, from Twitch you want to hear them yes sure okay so we have from a uh, quanto a Andre and Andre asked, hey guys, if you would have to choose a theory-based currency, what would it be? If I were to choose a theory? theory? A third-based uh, currency. Oh, because okay. If you already have Bitcoin, Ethereum, what would be the third one? What would be the third one? Oh, I already have a third one. It's called gold. I knew it. <laughs> I knew it. Right? So, um, I'm, I'm going to uh, stick with gold. Um, maybe Dash is not ready for that for me. Uh, even though I like Dash, it's not ready yet. Um, uh, if I were to think of another one, I don't think I can't think of any other uh, cryptocurrencies that are out there that are strong enough. Maybe Monero, maybe Monero. Also, actually, you know what? Now that I think about it, maybe Monero might be uh, another consideration for for me uh, in the future. But n right now, not yet. Not yet. It's not. It's not baked up. It's not shaken baked yet. It hasn't fully cooked. It's not ready for for prime time for me. Um, but uh, gold is, and so I'm going to be using both uh, a gold, uh, Ethereum, and Bitcoin for the foreseeable future. There's no way in heck that I'm going to be using local currencies such as uh, U.S. dollar, uh, my local currency here in Chile. Um, I'm I'm going to be holding gold, Bitcoin, and Ethereum. All right, with that said, thank you for watching. Thank you for participating um, uh, on my videos here. I really appreciate it. Please comment, please like, and please subscribe. Thank you all the people who uh, subscribed to my channel. Um, there's like, uh, right now, we added like about 150 people from last week, or more than that, actually. We added like 300, almost, uh, almost 300 people. And uh, yeah, and I'm looking forward to giving out rewards to holders of the DJ15 token. So uh, if you own some, you will be getting some rewards. All right. Thanks for watching and see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Now. Bye.